Okay, this is our recap of Project Runway, Muse on the Streets, uh, Season 13, Episode 10. This is our typical makeover challenge. We have one every season where they take real women, as apparently the models don't count as real women, and they give them some sort of makeover or something. They did this exact challenge in the Australian version of Project Runway, where they had to go up to people on the streets and do it. But, eh, meh. So Sean totally has this whole thing where he goes up to someone, and he's like, oh, do you want to do it? And she's like, oh, I can't, but my friend can. He's like, oh, I was looking for someone taller. And I was like, wow. What a dick. What, what a way to win the hearts and minds of American. Americans. Um, let's see. Oh, and then he's like creeping around the park. He looks super creepy. Anyway, everybody gets their stuff. Karina runs her mouth the whole episode. Oh, my gosh. I thought she straightened up. But no, no she no. was completely full of herself. Oh my gosh. And it hates was, everyone else because they, they just can't design. Right. Oh, it was just, it was brutal to listen to. And the episode, we got up this morning at like four or something to work on the ranch. And then <laughs> this episode never ended. Golly. <laughs> it was longest thing ever. In fact, ever. we didn't even watch the whole thing. We, we quit before it ended. So <laughs> we're just guessing at who won and who no, lost. No, we watched it. I we forced didn't want to. to. We didn't want to. Uh, so everybody does their dress. Um, let's see. Sean had the long, it was like, like a rock concert dress, but it was like a long black dress with fringe. So I hope... And the, the cups were all cut funny. Yeah, but anyway, he was safe. Karina had that blue leather jacket with sort of like a hound's tooth insert. Unfortunately, it was really good. And we were really disappointed in that. Um, also, the top was Keeney, of course. He's our guy. Uh, with a with a denim dress with a denim jacket, I agree it shouldn't work. Like if, if someone said, "Oh, he did a denim jacket on top of a denim dress," I would have, I would have thought it was awful, and it was super cute. Yeah, it and, worked. And they were saying how it was far too serious for a date dress, but it was fully like sh it, it completely. She looked adorable, and she had the world's cutest figure. And so I was like, I don't know what kind of dates they're going on, but usually if you show off, you know, you're in good shape. I've been on dates. This is a man's dog. This is a man's. Okay. And then last was um, Emily, who I thought was kind of, a, kind of a ridiculous dress in a way, but it looked really good at the model. Um, Who's Emily? Uh, it had, was the um, black and red dress with the oh, big... It should have been big here and then... Gotten smaller. Smaller here. Because it looked really good framing her neck, but then when it like came out here, it was a little, it was a little weird. Um, I think it super helped that the the gal had like a an accent and just it fit her so well that you were like, okay, it's ridiculous on anyone else, but somehow it seems right on her. So that was our top. Our bottom was Amanda with the with the zigzag outfit and the zigzags all went this way and Amanda's the one who came back. Oh, who came back from the last a different season? Remember? Oh yeah. You know she's kind. Of, she's kind of been a little touch and go, but she had a great line. So Char, she's we'll not get a to Dick like Karina. So Char had the zipper come out, and from what it sounds like, the model zipped it off, like tore it off the dress. And so Tim gives them the option of, you know, do you want to do it or not? And everybody after they say they all say it's fine or don't disagree. If you're going to say okay, then shut the hell up. Yeah. And so they all went back there and said how it kind of wasn't And Alexander there. should have left weeks ago. Yeah. Um, anyway, so everyone's making a big deal about how Char got extra time, and she's gotten two Tim Gunn saves. And I'm like, and then Amanda's the one who's like, okay, well, we all said yes, so. And I was like, thank you for... Thank you. I don't want to hear the rest of this, okay? We don't want to hear it. Anyway, and um, I don't know. I kind of have mixed feelings because other people are like, well, I didn't have time to put in a zipper. Well, she did put in a zipper, and then the model broke it. So I kind of feel, I kind of I kind of have weird feelings about that to begin with because the model did, like, rip it off the dress. And secondly, it, I, the judges found out about it. Yeah. So I kind of, and they took it into account. So I kind of feel like, I don't know. I just don't feel. I just don't. I just feel it's a non-issue. Yep. Anyway, um, so Char's outfit was awful. It was like it was like a romper you would buy for a three-year-old. Um, the color on our screen. No, the whole thing really wasn't the weird. color. It was the non-breakup of the one single color. Right. Right. No. I'm I, fair. Fair enough, John. I. 
<laughs> You're right. Uh, I know. It, I, it I is. It, it is. <laughs> it is hard to own like a unless it's like black or something. It's unless hard. Unless it's to, black, yeah. It, like a bright red outfit. Anyway, I don't know, that's really that's a really good point. Um, who did we we miss someone? Oh, and then Alexander with the okay. I I don't care if crop tops and high waisted skirts are popular. I just, I cannot get behind so it. So bad. I think... Which, which is typical from him, from what I remember I know, they, I, of Project Runway. I don't remember any of his outfit, so I'm fine with him going home. I mean, I'm sure, I'm sure he's a nice guy and all that. At least but, he's not like Korean and yeah. bashing everybody else. But I, I'm fine with him going home. And I, I, I like Char quite a bit, but I would have been fine with her going to home too, because that outfit was really bad. It was, it was really poor. But anyway... Nobody I, likes a mouthy... Jerk. Karina. Talking to you. I hope she doesn't see this. I hope she does. I, somebody needs to tell her that. Mm -mm. No one needs to tell her that. Somebody needs to tell her that. Anyway. Oh, you're going to get me in trouble. Anyway, Alexander goes home. Karina wins. Unfortunately, it was a really good jacket. But I, I really... But as a person... I, and, I'll, and, no, and as someone who was on my TV screen, which is, does affect me... She needs to just sh shut up for a while because it's like wearing on me. Anyway, that's our episode. Do you want to add anything? No. Okay. We're all done. See ya.